By the sun, are you Nora? I've never seen one at a hunting grounds before, or at the Hunter's Lodge. How interesting. What do you do here? This is a place to test yourself against a herd of machines in the stamina trials. Think you can handle it? I know I can. Excellent. I like your spirit. You're awfully friendly. Well, you know, it gets lonely in the wilds after a few weeks. Terribly lonely, in fact. What about your friend over there? Oh, he doesn't count. Barely ever opens his mouth, and when he does, nothing interesting comes out. Who are you? Why are you here? Well, I'm a hunter, of course. And a member of the Hunter's Lodge. But I don't mind being out here. At least no one complains about my clothes, or my manners, or my personality. Don't let him in, he'll drive people off with his incessant chattering. Or, he stinks of fish again. That sort of thing. I don't stink of fish, do I? No, it's uh, more like wet fur. Well, that's something. What are the trials? The Hunter's Lodge makes sure hunting grounds around the world offer hunters a place to train. The trials here focus on the most important part of hunting, keeping your stamina up. Hunting isn't a sprint, it's a gauntlet. So all you offer is training? And a herd of machines. Plus, I'm allowed to award marks. Half sun, full sun, and blazing sun, if you do well. What is the Hunter's Lodge? A place in Meridian where hunters gather, socialize, and brag a lot. Me, I just love hunting machines. If you win three half suns at any of the hunting grounds, you can enter the lodge yourself. I have to get going. You know where to find me.
can wait. I'm not done sitting. Watch out for the Asaram merchants. They'll soon cheat you as look at you. an outlet.
Stay low, girl, or you'll spoil the fun. Fun? Everyone has their reasons. Maybe you kill because you're compelled. I understand. Had a partner who'd weep at the feel of an arrow striking home. While we hunted the bandit scum, his eyes were never dry. Then you're a manhunter. Some kind of mercenary? Call me Nil. I've found where there is strife, there's bandits. Picking the bones of the innocent. Then whoever they can catch, then each other. But why wait? You and I could work together. Kill them all. What do you say? I don't know you. And I have no reason to trust you. Trust is a rare egg to find, isn't it? I'm just a traveler. With a bow, a concern about the state of these lands, and a missing partner. I don't think you're just anything at all. Hmm. Let me put it another way. Are you a bandit? Of course not. Then you have nothing to fear from me. All right. Someone has to stop them from hurting others. And we will. We'll stop them from doing anything. Save screaming a while. Go ahead and take the lead. I look forward to seeing what you're capable of. Go!
see you. But all goods entering the city are subject to search. This is outrageous. We're loyal citizens. How long do we have to wait? What am I supposed to do? Just sit here and let everything spoil? I thought Meridian was open to all, Karja. What happened to Ursa has nothing to do with us. They say it's for our safety, but... That won't pay for lost customers. I'm keeping my eyes open. What's going on here? Mullen's in there, somewhere. And so's Erend, that other Outlander I talked to the night before the proving. Erend said he'd introduce me to his sister if I visited Meridian. Said she was captain of the Vanguard. Down on account of the murder. Place the merchant. If this keeps up, I'll be broken a month. Always stay bright. Always My mother told alert. me to steer clear of Outlander. But you seem friendly enough. Stop happy. right there. In light of the recent attack, no stranger passes into Meridian without submitting to search. Recent attack? What are you talking about? The murder of Captain Ursa and her vanguards, of course. Ambushed by Shadow Karja forces in Redridge Pass. Ursa? You mean Erend's sister is dead? How would you know his name? I know Erend. Summon him. I need to speak to him. Ha! Huh. I doubt that Erend, the new captain of the vanguard, a man in grief is going to waste his time on a grimy outlander. Aloy! Hey, you're alive! I thought you were dead! Make way! Make way! All the way to Meridian, just to see me? Have you been drinking? Ah, not really. A little. So, you're alive! This, uh, we should celebrate! The drink's on me! We need to talk, alone, and you need to pull it together. Over there. So you approve? Of course I approve. From now on, she may come and go from this city as she pleases. As you wish, sir. There. Alone as you asked. And what did you want to tell me? I heard what happened to Ursa. I'm sorry. I know she was special to you. Special to me? <laughs> special to everyone. She always knew what to do. She bossed everyone around. She kept me in line. But now I'm supposed to fill her shoes. And instead, here I am, stumbling around in them.
I, uh... I lost someone, too. At the Proving. The man who raised me. His name was Rost. That's terrible. Why is it every time something terrible happens, everyone else tells you the worst thing that ever happened to them, so that makes it easier? Yeah. Why is that? Anyway, there was something you wanted to tell me? A lot has happened since we last spoke. The Proving was attacked by a group of killers. Not many of us survived. We were in the village when we heard explosions up on the mountain. Some of your braves came back, said most of the contestants were dead. I've never heard such a wail of grief as the sound that rose up from your people. How did you survive? How I survived is less important than how I was targeted. Targeted? What do you mean? The killers came for me because of Owen. What are you talking about? That doesn't make sense. I need to find Owen. I need to know what he knows. But... he's a friend. No, he's a traitor. I don't know who the killers are or what they want, but I do know that Olin is working with them. But... I mean... this... I don't need you to understand, Erend. I just need you to take me to him. He's not here. He went scrounging for scrap and relics days ago. It could be anywhere. Are there any places he frequents? Places he returns to? A house. Here in Meridian. Okay, then take me there. I need to search it. I guess. As long as I'm there to witness the search. I need to see Olin's place. Now. Okay, okay. Uh, come on. So many people are all talking at once. How does anyone think? I don't. I just drink. That girl. Is she... a mortal? Apparently they're letting anyone into the city these days. Blood for blood! Vengeance for Ursa! How long will Abad hide in his palace? To lay siege to the city, blood for blood, vengeance for Ursa. How long will Abad hide in his palace? Year after year, my sister murdered, and her death unavenged. One more word, you scorched out slag, and I'll throw you in jail myself. Now get out of here, or I'll give you all a kick in the ass. What did he mean about Ursa's murder? Not now. I live among piles of scrap from the old ones. Okay, how are we gonna get in? Uh! Oh, that was subtle. Here we are. Try not to break anything. Yeah. Other than the door. All of this for one man. It pays to have connections in the Sun King's court. The corner of this road is frayed. The floor near it is worn. Let's see what's underneath. Question is, how to get through it? Without a key, you won't. That's a vault hatch of Azaram make. Nothing gets through. We'll see about that. Hey girl, You're wasting time.
Just what I need. Looks big and heavy. Let's give it a little push. I did say not to break anything, didn't I? Aren't you going to see what's down there? Are you sure you're okay? I'm sober enough, all right? I don't need another lecture. That's not what I meant. I was talking about what happened outside, with the crowd. I don't want to talk about that. We're here because of what you said about Olin, so do what you need to do. Did Olin ever invite you in? Nah. Closest I got was a doorstep to help him home after a night out. We drank a river that night, but I hold it well. Y usually. You said Olin has connections in the royal court. Does he know the Sun King personally? No. He served the court as a scout sometimes and sold ancient trinkets to nobles, but he never had an audience with the king. If you're right, and Olin's into something dark, Sun King Avad has nothing to do with it. I'd stake my life on that. I'll look around. That's what we came for. told him to obey or they'd kill his family. Looks like Olin kept a journal. Olin? I knew he could read contracts, but I never took him for a poet. No doubt now. Olin knew I was targeted. The map. The glyphs show places he visited. There's your proof. Read the last page. He writes about meeting me and the order to kill me. He called himself a friend. That backstabbing cheat. How did you learn to read glyphs? And these things that you see, how do you do it? The focus. It reveals the unseen. And Olin's focus. It's the same? The device is the same, but somehow Olin and the killers can speak to each other with their focuses over distances. And see through each other's focuses, too. Like looking through each other's eyes. So that's how the killers saw you. Through Olin. Yes, so far as I can tell. Now that I know where to find Olin, I should be on my way. All by yourself? Leave it to me. I'm faster on my own. Wait. If that device lets you see the unseen... Out of the way, Erend. 
I'm asking you to help me, Aloy. I need to know who killed Ursa. Not just the, the Shadow Karja army, I know that, but the exact soldiers who did it. I'm sorry about your sister, but that's your war, not mine. Don't act like this isn't personal. You came here hunting the people who nearly killed you, who massacred your people. Why should you have justice and not me? Look, I'll head for Red Ridge Pass, where Ursa's body was found, and wait for you there. A few minutes of your focus is all I need. Don't make me beg. Red Ridge Pass, you said. I'll see what I can do. I'm stirring up tensions. I'm keeping my eyes open. It's not what I imagined when I was a boy, but it's decent work keeping the city safe.
Time to prepare. later.
Who's there? I'm going in. Body over here. Okay, 
You're okay. You hear that? <laughs> hmm, I thought. <laughs> Got a body over here. <laughs> Who did this? What the? 